Outside of Brunswick High School, more than 100 students and staff gather around a now empty parking spot, senior Alyssa Pernardo's parking spot. Honor her, you know, let her know she was actually loved because that's all she really wanted and she was loved by so many people. Paige and Kayla's best friend. And it was always so goofy. Always goofy. If you were upset, she would just do anything in her power and will just to make you laugh and smile. Cared about by everyone. She made everyone laugh. <laughs> it was our trio. Yeah. Brunswick police say the 18-year-old was shot and killed Tuesday night by her boyfriend, 18-year-old Logan Robertson, who was arrested for murder. Derek Zelenka is the school resource officer. Uh, Alyssa was a sweet kid. She. Um, She's going to graduate next week, and uh, she's very generous, very fun, um, just just a real positive kid. And why, instead of Brunswick blue, they carry purple balloons to the candlelight vigil. It explained her, too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It was definitely her color. Superintendent Jason Niedermeyer says the principal and staff members helped grieving students plan the memorial. It's hit our district hard. I mean, when you have a senior who's been here for 12 years and has been through you know, all of our buildings and, and people can reflect back on their time with this student. It's impactful. And as they release the balloons, the tears fall for Alyssa and her family. And through their grief, everyone hoping for justice. Just keep her in your thoughts and your prayers and hope for the, the best for her family and her friends. Hope justice is served. Yeah. In Brunswick, Suzanne Stratford, Fox 8 News.